Detractors of evolution often dismiss evolution on the basis that it is impossible to achieve life as we know it today by mere random chance like you evolutionists claim it does. Well, that's not what evolutionists claim has happened. Chance does play a role. It's what drives mutation. But there's more to evolution than just mutation. Evolution is primarily a process of natural selection which is not random at all. And that's what these people ignore. Now this illustration that I'm going to show you has been done before by a good friend of mine who would like to remain unnamed but who has since removed that video and I would like to reproduce what he did using coins instead of the dice that he used and some of you might remember that original video so enjoy my tribute to that video and here it goes let's say I've got five coins and I want to achieve five heads or with these Irish coins, five harps. And let's just see what happens if I try to achieve that by random chance. Now that's not a harp, that's a two. So already I know I failed. I failed miserably. So we have to try this again. Let's try this again. Second. And there's another two already, so no, again, I don't even have to look at the other ones. One, two is failure already. So let's try again. The third throw of the coin dice coins. Two. Holy bananas. Atheist nightmares. Why isn't this working for me? This is where one gets frustrated. And here it goes again. Another attempt. And there's another two. And I have to try it again. The fourth go that was. How frustrating indeed. So let's try this again. And there's another two there. So darn it and blast it anyway. So let's have to try that again. That was the fifth one. The sixth one. Again I fail. So, another attempt. The seventh one. Failure yet again. And here's number eight. Another failure. You can see where this is going. The chances of me randomly throwing five coins and getting the five halves are actually 32 to 1. Which are 1 to 32, whatever you want to look at it. Which are not too bad chances. You know, if you were patient enough, you would see it happen all right. But they're bad chances all the same. That was eight goes already and I wasn't anywhere near to achieving it. Maybe. Let's see what happens if I introduce natural selection now into the process. Here we go again, the coins. Now, there are twos there, and there are halves there, so I failed. But, now, natural selection dictates, we keep what works, and we discard what doesn't work. And let's try again. And there's another harp. That, alas, is a two. So that was the second throw. And there, that's another two again, the third throw, and a half, the fourth throw. Four throws, and I've re achieved my result. Now remember, by pure random chance, it would take me an average of 30 through two throws to achieve this. By including natural selection, I've sped up the process immensely. It now becomes something that is conceivable, that's feasible, that isn't miraculous, that isn't impossible by any means. And of course evolution is much more complex than throwing some coins, but the principle of natural selection is exactly the same.